Motorists and residents in Port Harcourt have appealed to government at all levels and relevant authorities to find out the root cause of continuous rise in price and scarcity of petroleum products in River State. They made the call as residents buy fuel at 200 naira per litre. The report. Some residents who were on queue to purchase petroleum product at the NNPC in Potako town complained that they have stayed so long without any hope of getting the fuel. While some who could not bear the queue are patronizing the black market where prices are exorbitant, they urged the government to as a matter of urgency intervene as all economic activities are beginning to be halted due to fuel scarcity. They called on the government to also resolve the pending issues between security operatives on highways and petroleum tanker drivers who were said to have parked their vehicles by the roadside along Aba Road for over a week now. The tanker drivers complain of how the security operatives have been allegedly extorting money from them. It's 6, uh, 5.30 in the morning, we are, we are on this queue trying to get free. Before yesterday, I bought it at the rate of 200 naira at a Liozu. But there is, there is fuel, and they are holding this fuel because of the issues they are passing through. Whenever they want to load, they are paying excess money to the security agent, which is affecting their product. And we, the masses, are feeling the heat. Not even then, the masses are feeling the heat. Just because day before yesterday, we started hearing about the, the fuel price we increase. Yesterday, yesterday, I bought this from Air Force, 250 naira per liter. It's very bad. And I'm a commercial driver. I find it difficult to make it because I bought for a very high price. It's very bad for what they are doing to us. And the election is coming. All these things, we're supposed to have them free. We're not supposed to suffer before we have common fuel. And this is one of the important things in life that the common need to have. So what we are saying is, let them release this thing anywhere they are keeping it. Well, the government are not helping matter. Instead of them to make things to be easy for the masses, so of us to go front, we are going backward every time, every time. We will not hear that we are going forward, we are going backward. It's getting out of hand. Like, see, we have been in hold of since, not because of the don't want to be bored, but because of the fuel scarcity. Even the filtration has been filled and still yes, nobody has been able to get fuel. We are still waiting. And the price of the fuel has increased. In filtration, we do buy fuel now 200, 300. Our supply market are telling us 500. No, we need help. We need help from the federal government. Let's look into this matter. As at the time of filing this report, most petroleum fuel stations in Port Harcourt were closed and those open up long queue.